What's happening guys? Welcome to another food challenge. And this is a very simple one. We have here a whole bunch of chocolate. I was craving a whole bunch of sweet, delicious something and I could only think of chocolate. I mean, it's currently Valentine's week, right? I might post this a couple days after Valentine's Day. It doesn't really matter though. I'm not doing this for Valentine's Day. I'm doing this because I'm craving chocolate and there's chocolate everywhere in front of me. I'm gonna go shopping at least. And now it's literally right in front of me. It's right in front of you. And this is very simple guys. This is an epic 10,000 calorie chocolate challenge. 10,000 calories of fudge cookies. 10,000 calories of some sort of like, I think German chocolate, Australian chocolate. We got them uh, Tim Tams, love them. Frere Rocher, so I'm assuming Italianos. Lint, don't know where you're from. Nutella, don't care. Black Forest cake, my favorite cake. Well, it's more like nostalgic. I just really love Black Forest cake. Guys, I'm gonna even have some free, like defrosting Klondike sandwiches, which I'm probably gonna eat first, just cause I don't want it to smell. So I'm just gonna put a timer for 30 minutes, guys. I'm gonna eat as much food as I can for 30 minutes, and I'm gonna try to hit 10,000 calories. So I got the timer on. Third, no. If you had just chocolate, what is like your absolute go-to? All right, put that in the comments right now, cause I only have about five. Wait, and we're gonna count you down in five, four, three, two, one. Let's eat. All right, we're gonna have to start off with these Klondike bars. Cause they gonna melt and they ain't gonna last. Oh, they're already not lasting. So it's a chocolate on top of chocolate donut. Let's go. Mm. So good. Mm. Oh. Mm. 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 Too good. Let's go for round two. Mm. Mm. Alright, this is another chocolate on chocolate. Klondike. Mm. Actually, I think it's called triple chocolate. With a fudge in it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, I still have reasonably <laughs> not as dirty hands. Mm, I'm gonna save you for last. I think I'm gonna go to these fudge cookies. Oh, I'm so great for these guys. Let's see if it's worth getting. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. Come on. Can I have a chocolate challenge without some Nutella? Everything to tell it tastes good. Cookies. Done. Alright. Frere Rocher. Guys. That's just the most magical thing in the world, isn't it? Mm. Frere Rocher. Done. Tim Tams. Oh, man. It's in. Flavor fatigue, still good so far. I don't even know what this is. All I know is German. Mm. Coconut. Coconut. Ooh. Mm. All right. I think it's like fruity nuts or nutty fruits. Something about fruits and nuts. Layer 15 comes in. Let's just change up the 
flavor though. cake so much. <sighs> Probably had more to do with the fact that it's like nostalgia. Because these were like the cakes my parents used to get. Yeah, these are the cakes that my parents used to get. For like birthdays and stuff like that. Eight minutes remain. I'm gonna try to make sure I just finish this. minutes done. I don't even know where I'm at. Okay, so cake is done. I'm gonna pause this, this video. I'm just gonna calculate how many calories I'm at. And I'm gonna see. I just wanna see where I'm at, okay? I'll be back. A few moments later. Alright. So I'm done. <laughs> and I actually I did the calculations. This was unnecessary. This would have taken me like 12,000, 13,000. That all I needed to actually finish was this, which is the lint. Um, I'm not gonna. I think I like the idea of trying to have my 10,000 calories in 30 minutes, and if I can't beat it, I gotta beat it next time. Besides, this is a nice little snack for the kiddos once in a while, and uh, that, same thing. So guys, I, this was unnecessary, man. I was way over 10,000 calories with this. This is what obviously kept me in the game. Just took too long and I was close, man. All the calories and the macros will be right here. I was really, really close, guys. Really, really close. It was good until it wasn't. <laughs> uh, that being said though, I'm actually gonna snack on these a little bit because that sugar fatigue is, uh, oh, so good. The sugar fatigue is really messing me up right now. Anyways, guys, you stuck around long enough to see me narrowly get defeated by this chocolate challenge. Hit that like, share in the comments. Marcus, that was a close one. And then while you're at it, be like, you should have had this though. How you didn't have this, how do you not, how do you have a chocolate challenge without this? So. Share with me what I'm missing out on, what you would have had if you had a chocolate challenge. Anyway, you guys, I'm out, man. See you next week.